shade. First of all, I never use black to shade. Your drawing will always look dead at the end. This is the same thing as using white for highlights. Another thing you shouldn't be doing is to only pick a darker or lighter shade of the color you're using to render your thing. There's nothing wrong doing that, but I think it can be better. So here's what I do. Use the round color palette instead of the square. To shade with the dark colors, first lower your base color to cool colors, and only then you can go down to dark shades. Same thing to add light. First go up to warm colors. You can see the difference. Here is an orange. You can tell this one tastes better. Let's put this in the trash and have fun. By the way, I lied in the beginning. Shading is not always easy. You won't believe how easy this is. Start by drawing some triangles randomly all over your page. Try different shapes and sizes. Then draw two lines down from each triangle. This castle drawing comes together really quick, so put a little bracket below what you drew. Before we do my favorite part, draw squares for the top of the castle wall. Okay, let's put some windows in each of these towers. We need a way to get into this castle. Let's draw the main gate with a single arch. Every kingdom needs a flag, which is the last step if you don't include dropping a follow. We drew a whole castle in like 30 seconds, which is why I say... Letter H. Letter H. One. One. Letter C. Letter C. Letter N. Letter N. Add tail. Add tail. Eye and mouth. Eye and mouth. Many C draw back. Many C draw back. Lots of letter O. Lots of letter O. Dinosaur is done. Easy way to draw a rose. And all that I can see, just another lemon tree. A letter P. A letter P. It's beginning to look an arc. A lot like an arc. Letter C. Letter C. Add feet. Add feet. Take a look in the five Hands. And ten. Hands. Listening once again. Many C's, then color. Many C's, then color. It's beginning to look a lot like Add Christmas. dots. Add dots. In every store. Draw smiling face but the and details. Sight to see is the holly when the dinosaur is done. Own.
You won't believe how easy this is. Start by drawing some bubble letter E's all over your page. Try different shapes and sizes, then draw two lines down from each E. This castle drawing comes together really quick, so put a little bracket below what we drew. Before we draw my favorite part, draw squares for the top of the castle wall. Come to think of it, we do need a door for our castle. Draw a single arch for that. My favorite part is adding the little windows to each of the castle towers. Add as many or as few as you want. Every kingdom needs a flag, which is the last step if you don't include dropping a follow. We drew a whole castle in like 30 seconds, which is why I say, It's day two, video two of my 31 day content challenge. And today it's a simple but effective art tutorial. So after you've drawn around your hand with pencil, use a pen to draw lines across the page. You can do any kind of lines that you like, but I prefer to do zigzaggy lines. When you reach the outline of your hand, start to slightly curve the lines. This will start to create a sort of 3D effect. Continue all the way down the page and don't worry about being too neat or uniform, it just adds to the effect. Which is kind of trippy, I should say. Just a few more lines left to do now. And there you have it, you're left with a simple yet effective art piece. Follow for more of my 31 day content challenge. to draw like this. Drawing process. It better doing a guideline first. It help you make the face proportions look good. I found the three circle technique on YouTube and it really helped me. I usually give my drawing original features so they can look different from each other's. Make sure to make the ears between the eyes and the nose. Here it is a mini tutorial for the eyes, nose, and mouth. I don't know how to do tutorials, so this is the best you're gonna get. <laughs>